day six update from my vitrectomy for floaters that Dr. Wong performed uh, back in Virginia. I'm now back in my home state of North Carolina and had just um, seen my local retinal specialist for a checkup, essentially one week after the surgery. Today is Thursday. I had the surgery done last Friday. So I wanted to give an update on how I'm doing. Essentially, um, surgeon today or the specialist today ruled out the three major complications that could have occurred from the surgery, which were, um, you know, retinal tear, and retinal detachment, and then um, infection. So, I mean, obviously these things could still happen, but at this point, one week out, probably the risk is the biggest up until this point, and has ruled out all three. So, obviously, huge relief there. I have been using two different sets of drops, um, an antibiotic and a steroid, um, four times a day for the past week, so I'm going to get a couple more days of that, and um, then I'm going to wean off the, the steroid over the next few weeks. Um, basically, at this point, eye is, is pretty good. I mean, some pain, especially in the morning, not terrible, but when I try to focus in uh, up close, that's when, you know, I can feel some pressure on the eye. It's more pressure than pain, but definitely um, can feel it there. Um, my doctor here said that's probably some swelling, some inflammation from the surgery. It totally makes sense. My eye is still red around the corners, bottom and the top of the eye. I'm also seeing some, some specks, some, some black spots, which I do not believe are floaters or part of my, the floaters that were in the eye. Um, dr. Wong had said they might have been some air bubbles. Uh, the specialist that um, I met with today, my local doctor said that could be or it could be some blood. Both of these doctors expect that to resolve in time, um, so which floaters you know would not on their own. So at this point, feeling pretty good about the surgery. I'm going to post another update in a week or so, but you know definitely progress and um, overall pretty comfortable with how things have worked out so far. Thanks.